Hi honeys, it's your queen bee. So I am doing my makeup. I just did my toner and my moisturizer, both by She Moisture. And now I'm gonna put on my primer. I'm actually testing out one today and it is the Smith & Cult Black Drop Mattifying Face Primer. So I'm just gonna do what I did last time and um, just put this on without a color corrector and then do the rest of my makeup. Okay, so this is like a charcoal thing. And you can see it's like black and kind of jelly. I don't know how well I'm going to like this. I mean, it smells okay. It looks like a face mask or like a jelly thing for your night routine. It doesn't really look like something I'd put on my face before makeup. Okay, so I have all of it from the package on my face. Okay, so after like working it in, it doesn't have that charcoal tint to it anymore. I still don't know how well I like it. I think I like the Smashbox one a little bit better, but we will really see whenever I get my makeup on and everything, just how well it is. So with that out of the way, I'm just gonna go ahead and start doing my, my foundation powder. And I'm just gonna be using the same one I normally have been using, which is the L'Oreal True Match in the shade N2. So, so far I think it does look okay with my foundation. It doesn't look like it made it um, like really gross looking. It looks very like airbrushed. It looks like good. Um, so I think that's good. So I'm gonna do my e.l.f. eyelid primer. Now I'm going to do my eyebrows, but I'm not going to do a whole bunch of fancy stuff to it like I normally do. I'm literally just going to do what I did the other day, and that's just going to use my last little bit is out of my Joa eyebrow pencil, and hopefully I can do both eyebrows and not have to use another pen. Okay, so I have officially emptied this little eyebrow thing, so I will probably start using the one I got from uh, Essence. So I'm just going to clean up my eyebrows with a Q-tip, and then we'll be done. So just like the Smashbox one, it actually made it very easy to get my eyebrow stuff off my like top and bottom just to clean it up. So I actually like that, but I still feel the Smashbox one is a lot better for me personally. So I'm just going to take the CoverGirl Easy Breezy Brow and take a number three down here, the highlight, and I'm just going to go underneath a little bit. So I just did my top and my bottom waterline. I did the bottom in the Essence Nude and then the top in the Milani Black. So now I'm going to do my eyeshadow. So for my eyeshadow, I just used both of these from the Physician's Formula. I did the um, golden one on the ends, of course, and then I took my EYN Bright Palette, and I did one of the whites, like the top one up here, and then like the lightest blue over there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually going to do my eyeliner, and then I'm gonna do my eyelashes. Okay, so I just did some of my eyeliner. I actually don't have my tape over here with me, but I did the white and the blue in the one that I got from Wish. I can't pronounce the name. But next, I'm going to do my black eyeliner, and I'm just going to 
try to blend it in with some eyeshadow and everything, but I'm going to try to do that off camera just so in case I mess up or it doesn't look good, I can just redo and try another idea. That's why I haven't really been filming what my process is, but I'm going to go find some tape and then I will do the rest. So I gave up on trying to do my fake eyelashes because I got one side to work and the other side just kept going on crooked and then whenever it did come on, it just kept falling off. So I just did my mascara, which is the Maybelline New York Lash Sensational Full Fan Effect and um, just finished up my eyeliner and my you know, eyeshadow. So the blush I'm gonna use is the Physicians Formula Baby One. So the bronzer I'm going to use is also the Physicians Formula Butter one. highlighter I'm using the white one from Physicians Formula so I am just gonna take the Physicians Formula butter thing um, the lip product thing it was literally just the first thing I grabbed um, I not I don't necessarily like it that much but I mean it looks okay if you guys like this video, don't forget to uh, like and subscribe, and then also make sure to follow my TikTok, my Twitter, and my Instagram, and I think with all that being said, thanks for stopping by. Love you.